Practicing some of my new talents, you new know. New talents, like yeah. what? Well, I'm trying to be a, like a talented raccoon, you know. So oh. I was doing some things like uh, d twirling and uh, twirling you know, balancing and a ball. Juggling with the balls. Or, yeah. Oh, yeah. You Wait know, a minute, Rob. Chicken balancing on the end of my nose and stuff. Stop like that. right there. Wait. Don't tell me you're trying to think of some way to get into those kids' stage auditions again. Well, yeah, yeah sort of. Cause I, I'm a pretty uh, talented raccoon, you know. Oh, Roscoe, you are. You're very talented. But how many times do I have to tell you? Kid stage is just for kids who watch our show, who want a chance to come on television and do their act. Oh, we, we, wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. What if I did something like really know. interesting, like, uh, like okay. uh, drawing cartoon pictures, like this one, huh? Oh, that's pretty, well, pretty, that's that's not bad, Roscoe. Pretty, that's pretty, pretty good. good. Yeah. You like that? But Roscoe, you're not eligible for kid stage. Hey, wait, you just reminded me of something. Wait, this wait. cartoon drawing. Later on in the show, our guest is a cartoonist. He's a great cartoonist, and you're gonna love him. Oh, He's really? All kinds of silly oh, 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 boy, we need to tell you. Why don't we uh, hurry up and uh, watch the cartoon then? Cause I, I want to meet this guy. This is gonna be great. Okay. All right, let's roll the cartoon. Go ahead, roll the cartoon, guys. <laughs> You guys, during the cartoon, go and get a paper and some crayons or felt pens or pencils, whatever your parents will allow you to use, because later on, when our artist comes on the show, he's going to teach you guys how to draw a picture of Roscoe. Me? So, oh, oh, okay, okay, now we can go yeah, back to the cartoon. Watch the cartoon. Roll the cartoon. <laughs> Do, do, do. Oh, hey, Ranger Charlie, I'm just getting all cleaned up here, you know, because mm -hmm. if I'm going to have my picture drawn, I want to make sure I look good, you know? We might want to get that shower cap off, though. Oh, I might. Why? Yeah, well, for your picture. Oh, yeah, it's, okay, I'm just about cleaned He's already up. here, Roscoe. He's here, whoa! Yeah. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> there sure. we go. Roscoe, oh. this is Bron hey, Smith. Roscoe, he's the cartoonist I was talking hey, about. Hey, dear, you're embarrassing. Ooh. How you doing, Brian? Oh, pretty good. It's such a, it's so exciting to be here. Mm -hmm. You know, of exciting animals in my life, I've drawn a Smokey the Bear. Ooh. I've drawn Bambi, Bugs Whoa. Bunny. I've even drawn Ooh. Deputy Dog. Ooh. But Ooh. all my life, I've always wanted to draw Roscoe the Raccoon. So today, Ooh, as my I'm embarrassed. Ooh. So, are we ready? Yeah, we're ready. Oh, yeah, okay, definitely. first of all, does anyone know what a basic shape is? You know what a basic shape is? Mm. A basic shape is a circle or a triangle, or a square, and another kind of basic shape is an oval, and it's like a, a stretched out circle, that's an oval. And so Roscoe, you Ooh. probably didn't know this Roscoe, but Roscoe is made up of a number of different basic shapes. And Ooh. if you look closely, you can see a big circle here. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. There's a big circle, here's two smaller circles, and raise your hand and tell me what this is. Ear. What kind of basic shape is it? A triangle. Here's another triangle, and this is a oval. An oval for Roscoe's nose. Those are the basic shapes. Out here we have a hand, which is an oval shape, and one, two, three, four, five fingers. Four fingers and a thumb. So are we ready to start drawing? Yep. Okay, here we go. Let's start with an ear up here. What big ears you have, Roscoe. Oh, yeah, what well, you better do. Where did you uh, get your ears you. from, your mother or your father? Well, it was a combined effort. Oh. I think they both had big ears. <laughs> yeah. That was a very good, a good answer there, yeah. Roscoe. Let's draw the other ear here. I wouldn't want to hurt either one of their feelings. No, yeah. I wouldn't either if I were you. Yeah. Okay, here's the second ear. We hey, blacked those, those just in. just like your ears, Roscoe. Well, yeah. Blacked in there. Now, it just let's triangles. follow it around and draw the side of your head Ooh. and down to your big shoulders there. Ooh, now we're you. drawing the right side of your head. You'll notice, by the way, kids, that I took a little bit of time to draw in his mask here. Has anyone ever wanted to see behind your mask, Roscoe? Ooh, well, I, I only let a few people oh. peek. Yeah. Oh, I see. Okay, let's come down and draw the hand. He up doesn't here. know Here's my mask thumb. doesn't come off. <laughs> and one finger, two finger, three fingers, and four fingers. And then we follow it around down here. And next, let's hey, draw. You're waving. Okay, let's start up here above your eyes, and let's draw this little shape up here. Is it starting to look like Roscoe yet? 
Mm -hmm. it's good. It's getting okay, here. let's keep going then. Maybe it'll look even more like you, Roscoe. You can tell because my mouth's open. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. that, you look better with your mouth open, Roscoe. Ooh, thank you. Okay, now let's come down and draw his eyes. And you'll notice that Roscoe's eyes are looking to the right. Eyes right. And the reason that your eyes are looking to the right, Roscoe, is because you're looking this way and you're looking that way. Roscoe is at a crosswalk. Ooh. And before you cross the crosswalk, you look this way and you look that way before you cross. That's what I tell my two boys. Mm -hmm. Every time we're on the street, I tell them to look both ways before they cross the street. That's a that's, good idea. That's, yep, that's, that's not a bad point. idea when you get to a, to a, a, a street corner to look for a crosswalk. Yeah, now let's black missing. your big nose in, Roscoe, and we got a little shiny spot there, and that's called a highlight. It's starting to look more and more like Roscoe all yep. the time. Yeah, it is. Starting to look like you, buddy. No. Oh boy. Let's. We've got you the top of your snout, which comes up like that, and we work our way around there. Little specks there. Now we've got your big. Have you seen a doctor about your tongue, uh, Roscoe? Who? Is your problem? Your tongue looks a little red for me, but uh, uh -oh. if it doesn't bother you, it doesn't bother me. That's from all that liver pizza. Oh. <laughs> the liver, the liver pizza. That's mm -hmm. right. I should have known. Okay, okay, we're concerned starting about to uh, wrap it up here, I think. All right. Does that look like Roscoe? Yeah. Yep. Okay, it's let's me. put a signature down like here. Roscoe when you're drawing at school, remember, always sign your drawing. And this is how I sign my drawing. When I was in junior high school, I started working on a signature. It took me many years to develop that. Now I can do it without even thinking. So I think that does it for yeah, Roscoe. It's me, all right. Looks just like you, Roscoe. Maybe you can hang that up in your bedroom, huh? It did be you really can find neat. a clean wall to put it on. Well, I'm just hanging up really high above everything else. Yeah, yeah, above all your junk. That sounds like a good idea, Roscoe. Yeah, that way good I can see. And you know what, Roscoe? Oh, Ron even has a video for kids. I thought maybe we could look at a little bit of it. Oh, yeah, let's take a peek. Out? Okay, that's Okay, let's idea. take a peek. When I see the waves pounding and the rocks behind me, I think about one of the most powerful of all God's creatures, and that is the elephant. Let's draw the elephant now and see what he looks like. The elephant, by the way, as you know, is very big. There's uh, a lot of large animals in the world, the blue whale, the sperm whale, the moose, the giraffe, but the largest of all quadrupeds, do you know what a quadruped is? A quadruped is an animal with four legs. The largest of all four-legged animals is certainly the elephant. I'm going to launch the kites. I'm going to hand them to Brad, and he'll show you how they work. Ready, Brad? Yeah. Here we go. Cool. And up. You are looking at a Trilby train, one of the most powerful kites in the whole world. Okay, get in front of me, Brad. Grab the straps. Ready? Yeah. Okay, let it go. Good. Okay, now bring them back down, Brad. Toward the camera. Cool. Good job, bud. Let's do it again. Loop them up. Up, 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 down. Toward the camera. Good job, bud. Okay, now let's bring them up. Up, up. Now down. Toward the camera. Good! Up and back. Good job, Brad. Pull him up. Up. 
Now, bring him toward the camera. Along the beach. Boy, doesn't that kite flying look fun? It looks like a bear. I'm going to try because... that. Yeah, hey, guys, be sure to keep your pen and paper by your television because later on in the show, we're going to give you Bronze telephone number. So if you would like him to perform at your elementary school, he can come and do so. I've got some elephant pictures to pass out to you guys during the break. Okay. Be right back. There you go. Hi, everybody. It's time for the birthday rap. Where's our rap music? Good tune. All right. Hey, kids, it's birthday time. So join us now for our birthday rhyme. We've got Roscoe, the kid, Ranger Charlie, too, ready to wish a happy birthday to you. Happy, happy, but a birthday to you. Ha, 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 happy. Happy, happy birthday to you. Happy, happy, but a birthday to you. Ha, 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 happy. Happy, happy birthday to you. And Bronze going to draw us another animal while we go to the cartoon. Oh, go right, for it, more Bronze. animals. This is great. Here he goes. And we'll be right back. If you'd like Bronze Smith to perform at your school, have a parent or teacher call him at 572-0421. Hey, Ranger Charlie, I got mm -hmm. today's winner, the new Kids on the Block tickets. Great. And his name is James Olson of Ordine. Yeah, we're going to send him two tickets so he can see new Kids on the Block February 13th at the Tacoma Dome. Congratulations, James. And I want to yeah. see what Braun drew over here this last time. What'd you draw there? I drew a Coco cat. Oh, look at that, Roscoe, a silly cat with a ladybug on its nose. Ooh, Pretty silly, it's huh? cute. I like that. Yeah. Well, Braun, we want to thank you for coming, and we hope you get to visit some of the kids at their schools. Thank you very much for having me, Ranger mm -hmm. Charlie, and you too, Roscoe. Okay, you guys ready for a big goodbye? Look over there at the kids at home. See you guys 